Dear friends, this is my tutorial level. In this video, I'm going to explain how to perform vibrational frequency calculation using VASP and analysis with VASP kit and JMOL. So this is the system I'm going to tell you how to calculate the vibrational frequency of this CO absorbed on FeN4C. Okay. So first you need to do geometry optimization with the ice pin tool with corresponding magnum tank. We already said many times this. Then make input file for frequency calculations with necessary changes in the in car file. This is very important. To do frequency calculation you need to add some important parameter for uh, frequency calculation. Then you will get the frequency in out car file. I will show you. Then using VASP kit you can get zero point energy and entropy. This zero point energy and entropy is very important uh, for uh, to calculate the Gibbs free energy. If you are doing the Gibbs free energy calculation like uh, CO2 reduction or uh, N2 re reduction reaction, O2 reduction or oxygen evaluation and whatever you need, need to get the uh, um, the uh, by zero point energy entropy of the absorbed species that means CO. So, if your system is a nitrogen N2, means you need to only get the nitrogen absorbed nitrogen frequency. So, if you are doing O2, just you have to O2. So, other intermediate means you need to get the corresponding zero point energy entropy of the, the corresponding uh, absorbed. Okay, then you can visualize. Uh, um, visualize the frequency with uh, j mode okay now we will uh, now we will uh, see our uh, input file for frequency calculation so actually this is the output file input file for optimization already we discussed many times and also this is the output file so now we will see the uh, input file for frequency calculation this is the co absorbed optimized system so uh, if you if you are uh, already I told you to uh, after optimization you take this uh, concord file so this is the optimized uh, CO system you take this system for uh, for the frequency calculations okay like single point uh, uh, frequency calculation so this is the input file for frequency calculations i took from that optimized geometry from uh, optimized uh, folder so this one uh, first i will, will show you the in car file So this is the in core file for frequency calculation. So what are the important modification we have to do? Yes, here this is the so other things are same. So here we need to change into at these three parameters. So I brown five and potium zero point zero two and N three two. So already we are added for optimization I brown two and potium zero point two just to make it like this hashtag. That means it won't read for this. Uh, uh, pair tax so it will re read under this ibron 5 under potium this one so other things are same there is no change so this uh, i wonder what dft d3 and uh, we have used pe and this is n cut 400 this are the same only so we need to uh, turn on like l orbit 11 if you want you can do this is be best better to use this is the corresponding magnum tag for the system so in our uh, we will see now our postcard file so if you see our postcard file 67 uh, carbon atom is there and uh, nitrogen 4 atom fe1 and uh, o1 is there okay so if so one more important things if you are uh, doing vibrational frequency calculation you need to fix the surface whatever you are using surface graphene and boronitride phosphorine or metal oxide and metals whatever you are doing you should fix the bottom uh, uh, you need to fix the all surfaces only you have to relax the absorbed pieces you, you, if your system is CO means you just to leave the CU for transition other things just you put FEF -F, F -F -F. so here you see I, I, I have fixed all the atom I expect one C and O so I will show you where it is located 
so you, you see all the atom i fixed here you see the last one is o so here also last one is o then you see this is the um, atom actually the atom number is 11 atom number here is 67 is there so here 77 is there up to 60 76 means there I, I have fixed up to here this is 77 means cal for calculation purpose i shifted down that postcard so this is our uh, c of co, CO molecule okay just if i put the ttt and i put here uh, ttt for o, that's all so just make it correct then save so if you are doing frequency calculation you need to fix the surface whatever you are using surface okay you should understand this that's all and this is the k point file i am using gamma 5 k point uh, for that we i want to complete it very shortly that's why i am using this gamma point if you are if you want to use uh, higher k point you can use you will get the good result so this is the port card file so just i will show you what are the uh, atom present in that our molecule so first carbon is there nitrogen iron o these are the four atom present in our molecule okay this is the script file for summation like whatever you are using this uh, optimization or a single point whatever this is the same only so uh, that's all actually i already uh, optimized and also frequency also done so uh, this is the the frequency output file so i will show yeah so we need to copy this path corresponding optimized one mm. cd paste it go to the path and uh, now you will see the all file ll you can see all our uh, card card was car out card file everything is there so now you can type g r e p grip c m minus one type of car it will read only the c m based one so this is the our uh, frequencies of the absorbed system okay so i think uh, this 1967 only the the absorption um, frequency of c o bond so now we want to see the zero point energy and vibrational frequency zero point energy and entropy this is very important for um, calculation of Q's free energy so for that we need to type VASP kit so i already installed so here you need to go catalysis electrochemical kit type 5 so now you can see here 501 thermal correction for absorbate you need to type the thermal correction for absorbate which means we are using the absorbed systems okay if you are using free gas based molecule just you can use this one so we need to type 501 then you need to type the temperature temperature means the normal room temperature 298.15 kelvin just that's all so the our parameter very here is there so this is the zero point energy of the system 0 0.22 so you can take this and uh, make a table and uh, put it for for the gibbs energy calculation then entropy contribution is this is the one okay yeah you can take always the ev unit that's uh, useful for calculation so here zero point entropy is 0 0.129 okay so this is the things you can uh, see your uh, vibrational frequency and the zero point energy and entropy okay then what we will do now we will visualize our uh, frequency using jmol software so this is the important things so to install a jmol this is the jmol i all downloaded from the web website you can uh, just google it you will get that uh, jmol site so you can download you can uh, no need to install so if you are not running your computer just to you install a java runtime environment then it will automatically work so uh, this is the jmol just click 
it will uh, run so just minimize this one okay so just you can you have to drag your uh, that frequency out call file so this is our frequency out call file yeah so this is our optimized the frequency file out call file we have downloaded so here you can go to tools start to vibrate okay start vibration i think sometime it won't uh, run so just you can click here that this one so if you want to this is the last one so we can see our cc vibration so for that you can type 111 so these are different kind of vibration this also different uh, so this is the our uh, vibration one co vibration uh, 1967 centimeter minus one okay so this is the absorbed system if the absorbed absorbed system is the frequency is uh, significantly reduced that means this activated so if you are free co molecule also this is a uh, uh, the free co molecule vibrational frequency is 2143 this means too strong this is relatively weak after absorption okay so like that you can see your vibrational frequency using j mode that's all so you can do your uh, frequency calculation using this kind of parameters and you can do um, gives free energy calculation yes if you like my content please like subscribe and comment and share and also like my video uh, and also click the bell icon thank you for watching thank you for your uh, kind time thank you very much